crushing foes and decimating enemies. This combatant holds the Draconic Fury, ready and waiting. Welcome to the Guild Wars 2 Elite Specialization Spotlight, featuring the Herald, the Dragon Knight, Traversing the depths of the jungle has allowed skilled revenants the ability to commune with an echo of Glint, the dragon prophet who sought to end the Elder Dragon cycle. Summoning just a fraction of Glint's power has given the Herald the ability to control the facets of nature itself. Heralds gain access to a new legend, Glint, within the legendary dragon stance and the facet of nature, which slowly depletes energy while actively granting a benefit of the legendary stances that are equipped. True Nature, which offers different effects based off of the legendary stance that the Herald is currently in. These abilities can damage foes, improve boon duration, and even strip boons from foes. The Herald also has special indicators around their character model, indicating which benefits are active. Let's discuss those buffs. Heralds gain access to facets within the legendary dragon stance. Each facet operates with an upkeep cost. Once the facet is activated, the Herald gains access to another ability in place of it. The facet of light, the healing skill, when upkept, grants regeneration to the Herald and nearby allies every few seconds. The active ability is Invert Light, which heals moderately, and then for the next few seconds turns all incoming damage into additional healing, putting the facet on cooldown. Facet of Darkness, when upkept, grants fury to the Herald and nearby allies every few seconds, but when activated, it breaks stuns, reveals nearby stealthed enemies, and inflicts vulnerability, while also putting the facet on cooldown. The Facet of Elements grants swiftness every 3 seconds when upkept. But when activated, it consumes the facet and blasts a target area with Dragon Breath, applying conditions. The facet of strength, when upkept, grants might to the Herald and nearby allies every few seconds. When activated, the Herald damages nearby enemies and gains massively increased damage for a short period of time. The elite skill is Facet of Chaos. When upkept, this pulses protection to nearby allies every few seconds. The active ability, Chaotic Release, summons an Echo of Glint to blast foes away from the Herald, damaging and launching them, while also granting the Herald super speed. The trait lines of the Herald focus heavily on improving the facet usage, while also granting buffs for the amount of facets that the Herald has active. These vary from increasing damage, movement speed, or defenses. There are also many traits that focus on supportive factors of the Herald's capabilities. Links for open world, PvE, and PvP builds down below. Skilled Heralds gain access to the Shield. Resembling the Dragon Glint, the Shield focuses on healing and supporting allies. Envoy of Exuberance grants protection to allies, then heals, and then grants protection again on its way returning back to the Herald. Crystal Hibernation channels a protective shield, blocking all attacks while regenerating the health while in this stasis. The Herald has multiple playstyles and effectiveness in all forms of endgame content. In open world, they can thrive in extended combat due to their sustain and energy swapping while also pumping out some serious damage. In PvE, Heralds can play the damage or supporting role depending on the need, while most PvE content focuses on damage. In PvP, the Herald absolutely obliterates as a mobile hit-and-run assassin. You cannot hide from them. Their incredible sustain and high burst makes them a worthy choice in any form of player versus player content. Channeling the power of the dragon, heralds echo forth the salvation of the races of Tyria from the dragon's corruption. Don't judge a dragon knight by their cover. There is a hidden fury that only an unfortunate few will ever witness. Interested in learning more about the Revenant? Click this video here to see the Revenant Profession Spotlight. Thank you for watching the Guild Wars 2 Elite Specialization Spotlight, featuring The Herald.